Hello guys. Today we learn Republic Day speech. Okay, 10 lines about Republic Day speech. If you like the video, like, share and subscribe for more videos. Let's start the video. First point. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Respected principal. Respected principal. Teachers. And all my dear friends. Once again. Good morning respected principal, teachers and all my dear friends. Second point. I wish you a very happy Republic Day. Very happy Republic Day. Once again, good morning respected principal, teachers and all my dear friends. I wish you a very happy Republic Day. Third point. Today we are gathered here. Today we are gathered here to gather here to celebrate 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 73rd 73rd republic day republic day once again today we are gathered here to celebrate 73rd republic day fourth point we celebrate we celebrate republic day Republic Day of India Republic Day of India of India on 26th of January every year every year and it is a and it is a national festival of india national festival of india once again we celebrate a republic day of india on 26th of january every year and it is a national festival of india okay fifth point on 26th january 26th january 1950 1950 Indian Constitution Indian Constitution Constitution came came into force into force so we celebrate so we celebrate this day this day a Republic Day of India. Once again, on 26th January 1950, Indian Constitution came into force. So, we celebrate this day, a Republic Day of India. Republic Day of India. Okay, sixth point. The Constitution, the Constitution is the Supreme Constitution is the supreme law of India. India. Okay, once again, the constitution is the supreme law of India. Seventh point. It is very important day in the history of india 
इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट डे इन द हिस्ट्री ऑफ इंडिया एट पॉइंट रिपब्लिक डे ऑफ इंडिया ऑल्सो रिपब्लिक डे ऑफ इंडिया ऑल्सो स्टैंड एज स्टैंड एज a testimony a testimony for our for our freedom fighters for our freedom fighters freedom fighters and their and their sacrifices and their sacrifices sacrifices ninth point dr bhim rao ambedkar bhim rao ambedkar who is called who is called the father of ane our constitution once again dr bhim rao ambedkar who is called the father of our constitution constitution 10th point we should understand the we should understand the importance of this great day importance of importance importance of this great day once again we should understand the importance of this great day jai hind jai hind jai bharat jai bharat